Um, let me see where we are here. Hold on a moment. Oh, we did the microbiome. You okay. Want, you yeah, want, an, want an interlude? I can always sure, fill in. So gonna, I, want, oh, okay. I want to tell you something about this virus. I'm going to put it on the floor because I play with it too much. Um, one of the it's cool, like a rosary. I have to tell cool you the way you keep... About, <laughs> I never thought of it that way. <laughs> it would take you a long time to get through it. Yeah. So this, uh, this beaded genome, it's 7,400 bases long. And one of the cool things I, I like to do is show you how it comes out. Now, it's roughly to scale to the virus particle. And um, when a virus infects the cell, the genome, of course, has to get out. It doesn't do any good to stay in the particle. The genome has to get out. It has to specify new virus proteins, and it has to replicate and so forth. So this happens very quickly. So when this cell, uh, when this virus encounters the right condition in the cell, the genome comes out. And guess what? It comes out in less than a second. And now I've spent 10 seconds getting this out here because it's all tangled, right? And I, I can't really figure out the right way to do it. And now I've got it out. So there's something magical about the way this genome is put in to mm -hmm. the particle, and we have no idea how it works and how it gets out so quickly. And for many viruses, there's a huge amount of uh, genetic information packed into small particles. Right. It's under high pressure. We don't really understand how that happens, and we don't understand how it gets out so quickly. So really fundamental things remain to be understood. Why does it have to get out so quickly? Do we know that? I'm not sure it has to get out quickly, but it does. It does. Right, so the particle is in the cell. There are presumably defenses that are going to be mounted against it. It's a foreign particle. It's going to be recognized as foreign. So I think it's the idea, what it needs at to least from quickly. our interpretation, and here we're applying human values to a virus, which is always a problem, it would like to start replicating quickly to avoid these defenses but it certainly gets out extremely quickly and how it does so and not get tangled up and be properly recognized and so forth is, is a mystery. Remarkable. It's unknown, Stuart. I understand. That's <laughs> what we're talking about here. Well, so, yes. Uh, I mean, uh, do we yet know... I mean, I think we know the outlines of how a virus gets into a cell or chooses a cell, but, I mean, that's not a trivial 